A disease impacting corn has been found in Tippecanoe County. Tar spot was identified in Indiana in July, earlier than it had been in previous years. I spoke to a field crop pathologist at Purdue about what tool farmers can use if you find tar spot in your field. It goes after the corn that's looking the best out there. 18 counties in Indiana have confirmed cases of tar spot, including Tippecanoe, Carroll, Howard, and Benton. We were fighting drought more than water recently, but we did have some good rainfalls that have saved the crop in some areas, and that also triggered the disease. In order for tar spot to take off, Darcy Talinko says it needs humid conditions with hours of leaf wetness. But we also see that it needs a fluctuation, so it needs the leaves to be wet, and then it needs them to dry off, and then wet again. One little black dot like this of tar spot can rapidly spread and eventually look like this. Talinko says it can cause a lot of damage and also lead to yield loss. If it is able to get up into that upper canopy and we have 5% or more of infection up there, um, we can see significant yield losses and those severe years we've documented anywhere from 20 to 60 bushel yield loss. Breaker. If you do find tar spot in your cornfield, Talenko says the next step is to download the tar spot app on your cell phone. So this is what it looks like on the opening page of if you downloaded the tar spotter app. Through the app, you'll be able to make a list of all of your fields. The neat thing about this is once you get all your fields that you're interested in, you can actually go in and pull up a map and it'll update daily. The app will show weather conditions and if they're favorable for tar spot. It'll also help farmers make informed decisions about if a fungicide is necessary. And we have tables available. There's information on efficacy of the, the various fungicides for controlling it. Right now, Talinko says farmers need to be scouting their fields and if they've had tar spot before, it will come back if the conditions are right. The so first thing is to know is it on your farm. And then, you know, look and scout, scout for your, in your corn to see if you can find it. And then, um, then you can make that informed decision if a fungicide will be necessary. Talinko says experts are still accepting samples at the Purdue Plant and Pest Diagnostic Lab. She says the samples can be sent in if you're needing confirmation on whether it is tar spot or not.